from the Child Protection Party. Glad you could be with us for this brief video. Child protection hearings are normally held in the youth court. It has been a concern of ours for years that this is an inappropriate place and an inappropriate process to process issues in relation to children, particularly in relation to child protection issues. Firstly, it's a court. Secondly, courts are normally there to prosecute people for crimes. And so we think that being within a youth court is an inappropriate place just in and of itself. It's a no-brainer. So what we are proposing is that a group of people are formed, which would be a panel, I guess, and on that panel would sit certain people who have the authority to listen to the issues raised by the department on one hand and the parents on the other. And we are suggesting that there not be any solicitors involved at all. The only people that may have any legal input would be those people on the panel. And we are suggest suggesting that a judge be one of those people appointed on that panel. Usually a panel perhaps of about four or five people, including a social worker, a psychologist, a judge, and someone appointed from the community should also be on that panel as well. And the idea would be to listen to the parent tell their story about their involvement with the department and what has happened in their lives that have brought them to that particular point. And for a negotiation to take place between the department and the parent, heard by the panel, so that outcomes can be agreed upon that all parties will accept. And then they come back to that panel further down the track to talk about the progress that's being made. Now, to some extent, we see this within the reunification court, but the reunification court is held before a judge, one person. We need a variety of opinions, a variety of perspectives to bring to that one case. Now, some people may argue that it might be a bit cumbersome having so many people there, but if we're talking about an outcome which is gonna better serve the child and the parents, then we need to have a group of independent deci decision makers coming together to bring about the best possible outcome for kids. So the child welfare hearings would be a way of getting rid of the problems that sit, we believe, around the youth court, whereby it's a trial. And in that trial, the parents are going to be litigated against because of whatever the department believes were the issues that brought them before them in the first place. It's inappropriate. It's unhelpful. It's unwieldy. And it's costly. So the better situation would be a hearing. And this is one of the key policies of the Child Protection Party, to be able to move child protection issues out of the youth court into another place, whereby we believe it's far more equitable and fairer. Thanks for watching this video. Take care of yourself and be safe.